Hey guys, okay. Um, I am back. I don't even know if I'm in focus. Good gosh, I don't know if I am. Okay, if I'm not in focus, then just... Yeah. Um, okay. Oh my gosh, I'm swooshing my hair again. I, it's a bad OCD. I just like... Because I, I run my hand through my hair, and then I shed, and that's not good. So, yeah, I mean, it's puberty, so... <laughs> okay, so today is a happy day. Not only is it the day before Halloween, but it's also the day that Mandalorian starts back up. So, super excited about that. Gosh, this lighting is not the best. Okay, so... Um, to, so, okay, so I posted the video saying that uh, Mr. Bean Season 2 was in the works, and in the video I said that I will be posting another video talking about just, you know, future, some of the movies that I've already announced, and some of the, and just more movies that I'm going to announce in this video, and... Here, this is the video I was talking about. It was a little while. It was a little bit of a wait. I apologize for that. But, yeah. So, okay. So, let's get started. Okay, so we're going to start with the future stop motions. Um, so, in my five-year anniversary video, I announced... Um, I announced a Captain America stop motion, a Captain Marvel stop motion, a Johnny English stop motion, and then more installments to the Sleeping Saga, um, and then, I'm trying to remember, mm, oh, yeah, and I also announced Mr. Bean Season 2, which I'm going to say I'm very happy to announce. The first episode is finished, um, I still have to do a couple more, <laughs> but... Yeah, so, Mr. Bean, probably not coming this year, maybe next year, but, I mean, it's not going to be a super long wait, I can assure you of that. Um, and, here, let me see, oh, and I also announced a new LEGO series called Kylo Undercover, and I'm going to dive into that right now. So, if you all remember from... 2015, uh, Saturday Night Live did a skit of, like, Kylo Ren going on to Undercover Boss, and he goes undercover, and he goes to Starkiller Base, and it's really funny. So, I'm going to be, the Kylo Undercover Lego series is basically going to be based off of that, so it's, he's going to go back undercover, and that's basically what the whole series is going to be. And yeah, it's going to be really funny. And um, I have started to write the script, the screenplay for the first episode. I'm almost done with it. Um, but yeah, I don't really know when that will come out. Probably 2021. But yeah. Okay, so another one on the list. Um is Mandalorian Chapter 2. Um, that's fun, because, you know, today is Season 2. Um, so, I will be making that very soon. So, it's not going to be a super long wait. You, you can probably expect it by December of this year. So, yeah, but, um, yeah, so that will be coming out kind of soon, um, yeah, it is a little hard, because I'm making Mr. Bean on top of that, and, yeah, so it's a little hard to just kind of, yeah, you get the point, okay, so, I'm also going to be making a third solo, Han Solo stop motion, um, if you guys remember, back in 2018, I made Han Solo shoot off, and then, was it the same year? 
I think it was the same year. It could have been 2019. I made a sequel to that um, called The Imperial Heist. And so basically, number three, Solo and Enfys Nest, that's going to be a continuation off of those two stop motions. So, yeah, that will probably... Um, I don't know when that will be coming out, so... <laughs> Yeah, I don't have for sure, I don't have the for sure release dates of a lot of these, but, yeah, um, yeah, they'll, yeah, it won't be a super long wait, I hope it won't be a really long wait, but, yeah, anyways. Okay, so this I did not announce in the anniversary video. If you guys remember from, in 2019, I made a Star Wars Resistance stop motion. And it left off at quite a bit of a cliffhanger. I'm going to be making a part two. Um, and it's going to be a continuation off of the first one. So you're actually going to get closure as to what happens um, to the characters. And yeah, I mean, and that will be the final resistance stop motion. I might use the characters like I did in epis in the fifth Sleeping Saga movie, like how Kaz was in the there in that First Order base and he helps Leia escape. Um, I'll probably like use those characters for that kind of stuff, but for like stop motions that are directly based off of Resistance. The second one will be the final movie. Okay, so Sleeping Saga. Um, the Sleeping Saga is going to... I So, overall, because I've already made five, Force Goes Back to Sleep, uh, Rebuilt General Grievous. Grievous. <laughs> um, let me think. Yeah, so Force Goes Back to Sleep, Rebuilt General Grievous, Battle of the Sith, First Order's Comeback, and... How could I forget the name of the fifth one? The newest one. The newest one. Okay. So I've made five so far, and I want there to... Overall, there's... I'm planning for there to be nine, like the Skywalker Saga. So, yeah, so episode six will be coming out soon. Um... Yeah, like, I know what it's going to be about, so... Yeah, so that should be exciting. Um, next, I'm going to talk about a Johnny English stop-motion that I announced in the anniversary video. A Johnny English, Rowan Atkinson, Johnny English. Um, I'm going to be making a stop-motion based off of that, and it's going to be a talkie. There's going to be dialogue in it. And it's going to be really funny. That'll probably come out 2021. Yeah. Or it's sooner than that. I don't know. But yeah, I'm going to start writing the script for it soon. I need to ask some people if they want to do voiceover. So I'm going to have to, you know, if I can get them on board, then Johnny English will for sure be happening. And this one I'm really excited about. It's a Scooby-Doo stop motion that I've been working on for the past year. And I am going, because tomorrow is Halloween, I'm going to upload it to my channel tomorrow. And that will be coming out tomorrow. So, yeah. So, you guys should really, if you guys want to watch it, um, just go on YouTube tomorrow and you will find it. Um, well, unless it gets blocked. If it gets blocked, then you're probably gonna have to wait a week. <laughs> but, no, it, it'll be fine. I'm also going to be making an Indiana Jones stop motion. The first Indiana Jones stop motion. Really excited about it. Um, it should be really fun. Don't know when it'll come out, but, yeah. You should, yeah. It'll... It will come out, it will happen, I can assure you of that. So in the anniversary video, I also announced the first Marvel stop motions, um, Captain America and Captain Marvel. 
I'm really excited about them. I am really close. I'm like, actually, I'm basically done taking the doing the picture part for the Captain America stop motion. So Captain America should be coming out really soon. I can assure you of that. And Captain Marvel. I don't know when Captain Marvel will be coming out. Pretty soon, I guess. Not too long after Captain America. Um, but yeah, I'm going to work on that pretty soon. And this one I did not announce in the anniversary video. Uh, Black Widow. I'm going to make a Black Widow stop motion. And that should be coming out, I want to say probably like 2021. Yeah. Um, that one might have a little bit of a wait, but yeah, I mean, I'm excited to make it. I'm excited for you guys to see it, and yeah, I'm really excited about starting to make Marvel stop motions, because I love the movies, I really do. So now we are moving on to the live action movies. The Marvel stop motions, Captain America, Captain Marvel, Black Widow, they're not going to be the only movies coming out that will be based off of the Marvel movies. I'm making, my friends and I, we're currently making a mockumentary about Spider-Man. It's called His Great Responsibilities, and that should be coming out probably sometime in November. Um, we're about halfway through filming, so... Yeah, that's, I'm really excited about that one. I'm really excited for you guys to see it. It's really, it's pretty funny. Okay, so now we're going to be talking about Ryan Gilbert's Epic Life Super Duel number four. Um, I don't know for sure when this will be coming out. Probably 2021. I'm not going to have you guys wait for a super long time like you guys had to do for plot thickening because that... That wait was ridiculously long. Like, I was losing, losing patience. <laughs> um, yeah. And I don't really want to spoil this one because I just don't. <laughs> I mean, I don't really want to spoil any of my movies, but you guys, if everything for the movie goes as plans then I can assure you, you guys are going to be pretty freaking excited for it. Starting in late November, uh, Star Wars Theories 4 will be starting. There won't be as many episodes as there were, as there have been in the past seasons, but yeah, there'll still be quite a few, but it will be a crazy season, I can assure you of that. Now we're going to take a look at the universe. Um, and when I say the universe, I mean the Gills Films universe. Not this universe. If we looked at this universe, we would find out that it would be very disappointed in Gavin Newsom right now. So far in the Gills Films universe, we have World War B. The R and the G and the missions of Nick and Bill. So, I'm about to. We're about to dive into more titles that will be taking place in this universe. The next title, the next movie you will see, will be the Kung Fu Gnomes, which it's a little different from you know the movies I've done in the past, but it's gonna be good. I can tell you that it's going to be about obviously Kung Fu Gnomes. And basically, they're going to be fighting this big villain, or a man who works for this big villain, who is plotting to take over the world. And basically, that's the just that's like the plot line of it. Um, it's based off of a board game that I made for school, and. Basically, we played it, and everyone was like, you have to make a movie of this. So, I will be making a movie, a Kung Fu Gnomes movie. My original plan 
for the Kung Fu Gnomes was I wanted to release it like this past summer. Um, obviously that didn't happen with crap vid and stuff. Um, so yeah. Um, so the next movie, oh wait, well hold on. So Kung Fu Gnomes probably be coming out this December, November, December, early December, late November, sometime around there. I really hope it does. <laughs> I've started writing the script, I'm about halfway through it. And uh, yeah, I'm excited for you guys to see it. Uh, the next movie after the Kung Fu Gnomes will be uh, Nick and Bill 2. You know, a sequel to the first Nick and Bill, obviously. Uh, since the number two is in the name Nick and Bill 2. And my original plan for that was for it to come out, like, this month. Obvi obviously that hasn't happened, and it's not going to happen. So Nick and Bill 2 will probably be coming out around the same, near the same time as Kung Fu Gnomes. Um, but, yeah, it'll be funny. It'll be probably funnier than the first movie. Um, yeah, it'll be, it'll be good. I'm excited for you guys to see it. I'm gonna say that for every movie that I announce in this video. I'm going to be excited for you guys to see it. <laughs> so, yeah, just prepare yourselves for that. Oh, well, no, you don't need to, because I've already, you know, said it, so. Okay, the movie after that will be... Out of Time, which I might change the title of that. I don't know. But this one's a fun one. It's um, it's going to be about these two teenagers who are aspiring filmmakers. And basically they go to make a movie about time travel. And in the process of making it, they accidentally travel back in time and this one probably it'll probably come out soon yeah um maybe around the time that kung fu gnomes and they can build two will come out um and then after out of time we're going to have the modern day nights i don't know I'm debating on whether this should be a movie or a series, like the R and the G. Um, but The Modern Day Nights is going to be about this team of secret agents who work for the same spying agency that Nick and Bill work for. And basically, like, they're very good at what they do, but they have to do very ridiculous things to solve their mysteries so it should yeah it's definitely gonna be really funny uh all these they're all gonna be funny i mean you know i like making funny movies um but yeah that should be a fun one okay and then after the modern day nights or it might be before the modern day nights i don't know but after that the next movie will be uh jason john which that one's gonna be, I'm really excited for Jason, I mean, I'm excited for all of these, but I'm really excited for Jason John. It's going to be about this dude who is super into the 80s, and he accidentally creates his own world in space, and it, it goes on from there. Yeah, it's it kind of hard to explain. I'm still working on the story for it, but yeah, that should be coming out probably... Probably 2021, but yeah, and that is it. That is all the movies that I wanted to talk about. Um, there will be other movies um, that I haven't announced in this video or in the last video. Um, there will be other movies along the way that you will see and but they'll be good. Yeah, they'll be fun ones. Um, so obviously, the stuff that I announced in this video, it's not going to be the only 
you know, it's not gonna be the only stuff, but yeah, so yeah, thank you for your time, brethren and sisters. Um, I get, um, Scooby-Doo is coming out tomorrow, so keep an eye out for that if you want to watch it, and have a good Halloween tomorrow. Um, will there be another Monster Mash video? I hope not. 